Welcome back to the Czech Republic. And amidst the rolling hills, we have a team that are pretty happy with what 2015 have brought to them so far. The Kemia Yamaha Yamalube team. With championship challenges in the 125 and 250 European classes and impressive rookies in MX2, the Belgium squad have every right to look at the future with hope. He has that talent uh, to be really fast on a 1-5 to five bike and you know the youngsters they are a little bit wild. Some riders has problems to coming from 85 to 1-5. to five. He was really fast in the, in the beginning already and that was perfect. So it was a really big decision of the team and Yamaha because uh, Damon uh, should be going uh, really good in the, in, in the, in the MX2 class some reason in training I saw that Brandt was doing really good. He was uh, fast and he was ready to go also to the MX2. So I had a problem. I had three riders who could go to MX2. I could train like really all winter long and uh, never had that like never had it before like the years before. We went to France often. My teammate Patrol you know there are some good tracks and uh, a lot of people. Like they water the track for us and uh, make it loose, like perfect, you know, like GP tracks. Damon was going down and he needed something from the team to say, hey, you have to do something to come back for his own good, you know. So that's why my decision was to go down with him to a European Championship. They just wanted to me, uh, wanted to have me in the GPs, and I was so happy. I, I took that chance uh, immediately because it is always my dream, and maybe you never get that chance anymore. If you see now what's happening, I think uh, I did a good uh, move with those riders, both now uh, going on top level. No, we're such a good friends. He's a really nice guy. Sometimes you need to be careful in the race that you that you don't uh, yeah think like he's my friend and and and, and uh, just just see him as another rider, you know. Yes, I want to uh, push every race, but because uh, when I born, uh, I want to become professional in motocross, and uh, it's really important uh, to arrive. Uh, in this level and uh, it's my dream to ride in World Championships. Yeah, it's tough. <laughs> it's uh, really tough, I know. <laughs> Not easy when you lose your teeth in the race and you just keep going. It's uh, my personality. I'm not uh, top in pit lane. I don't like that because uh, the team uh, work really hard and me. It's my uh, it's my profession. Yes, I have pain uh, in qualification, but it's better to finish 20 or uh, 40. I take a small point, but uh, for the championships, it's important. You see that he has the speed, uh, he is physically in shape and it's the first year Grand Prix so it's also experience I think. So next year if we have a good winter with both riders I think we can have a, have a good team.